the 29th pick in the NFL draft, the New England Patriots select defensive tackle Dominique Easley from the University of Florida. This is a guy that's going to provide some depth. They didn't really need much across the front. They just wanted to get a little deeper. They had the 26th ranked defense last year. They needed to get some more pressure on opposing quarterbacks. He'll help. The question I have, though, is how healthy is he? He tore both of his ACLs while playing at the University of Florida and why he never put up eye-popping numbers. He was very, very solid, took on double teams, did a lot of dirty work, and when he was asked to make plays, he made plays. The numbers may not be there, but he's the type of guy that makes a ton of plays when you watch the film. If you want to go another direction, if you're the Pats, you can look at Texas Tech's Jace Amaro, a tight end that's still out there. I'm surprised he is. Look at what numbers he put up. 106 catches last year, 1,352 yards. This is a guy that can stretch the field, run every route. You know how Tom Brady likes to use his tight ends. We know Aaron Hernandez ain't showing up anytime soon, and Gronkowski got injury issues, so he likes to use those two tight end sets. He would have been a perfect fit in this offense because they love to score points. Tom Brady loves to air it out, doesn't have much time left. Amara would have been a great pick for them. I give this a C because it was an area that they didn't really need, but they went out. You know how Belichick, he's always thinking ahead. He knows what he wants. He's going to probably make a move with that D line down the road. We wanted to get some depth in there. We'll see how that works out for him. I'm Doug Chapman. Pete Futek and I are covering the first round of the 2014 NFL Draft here on Campus Insiders.